Next, I actually think the incoming Labour government is going to be a bit of a blessing, not so much for the country, but for the mm. prospects of a, a radical patriotic party making progress. The worse it gets in this mm. country, the more people are going to be forced to vote for something outside the box. So if you can still go on holiday, mm. you've got a stable job and you can pay your mortgage and you can watch X Factor, and you, you might moan about the boats coming over the channel and all the other problems, but generally your life is not impacted. What I think we're going to see over mm. the next 10 years is people's personal lives disturbed to quite a, a significant degree. It, it, politics is going to come home to roost for a lot of people. Because as the ancient Greek philosopher said, you, you, you can ignore politics, but politics won't ignore you. The pe people's individual lives are downstream yeah. from politics a lot of the time. And sometimes it <laughs> takes a long time for, for problems to really manifest themselves in people's lives. Can you imagine Keir Starmer and Angela Rayner running this country? For me, my, my purpose, my driving mission for the last 25 years of my life has been to save the country. But mm. what, what I don't want is for there to be a slow, gradual decline where yeah. people, people adjust, people get used to it, people move away. People, I, essentially, I want things to get so bad so quickly in the shortest possible amount of time that it forces people off their backsides uh, and, and then outside of the mm. Westminster duopoly. That's what we need. And I think at the moment we've got a perfect stall. Mm. We've got Nigel Farage and Reform taking a sledgehammer to the two-party system. Then you've got Labour coming in, a new Labour government, which is going to be worse than anything we've ever seen. Can't blame a dog for barking. Labour are Labour. They're going to accelerate mm. immigration. Yeah. They're going to unleash woke extremism. They're going to do nothing to stop the boats. In fact, mm. a Labour government, news of a Labour government is going to spread throughout the third world, and I think it will increase the boat invasion. We're on the cusp of everything about to be getting worse and worse and worse, and we're also in the middle of a major realignment with Nigel Farage and the former taking a wrecking ball to the to the two-party system. Mm.